All right, we got the frame machine on the ground. Got our first first pull on it. It's not much of a pull. Truck's a little big for it. Just got some damage right down here. We need to hook a clamp to it and pull it down. Not a big job, but hey, it's the first job for the frame machine. Many more to come, we hope. Okay, here's the first one off the frame machine. We got that pulled down. Got it all looking better. It's ready for some filler work now. We'll get that paint cleaned off, get some filler on it, get it worked out and get some paint on it. And we're going ahead and pulling another one on the frame machine. Okay, we got the next little job on the frame machine. Some of y'all might remember this truck from uh, previous videos. Uh, when we got this shop here, it was sitting here and we got with the guy that owned it. And he wanted us to get it running for him, so we put a motor and stuff in it. It was his dad's truck. And he was all excited about driving it. and He drove it for a little while and someone ran into him. Well, the insurance was going to be too much to fix it, so... He just decided to let it go. Well, we ended up buying it from the insurance company. And now we're going to try to get the front end pulled over, get another front end on it, and make a shop truck out of it. Extended cab truck, short wheelbase. Got the FE motor. But we got it up here on the frame machine. We're going to try to get this front end tore off and get them frame rails pulled over. Okay, it's about dark. We got the front end off. Now you can see the frame rails, how bad they're bent. We'll get this thing chained down. Get the tower over here. Pull them over. Are ready? Yep. We got a old hood off of a late model truck. We're going to cut the center out of it and mold it in a 93 Ford truck hood. Ready? Let's get at it. I don't want to tell them what it's off of. <laughs> of course, <laughs> the big lettering yeah. right there. We don't want nobody to know what it's come <laughs> off of. <laughs> Center part. Four man's ram air. 
<laughs> right. Now I get the other hood over here. What's the fun in there? All right, we got the turned upside down here. I'm gonna try and get everything cleaned off of it. Get it smoothed up. Get it ready to test fit. All right, here's our 93 Ford truck hood. We're gonna start setting it up, trying to find a center, getting it exactly where we want it, and then start doing some marking for some cut. One may be in the truck, yeah, ready. Or inside. It's hard to tell in the box. Well, two's in the back seat of the brown one. We took, if it didn't get run on your trailer, we took it out to see if it fit. Probably the door handle, and then you can, <laughs> what about the spray box? <laughs> you know, all, everybody's oh, grabbing it. It's like that guy on that little video somebody sent us. He lifts a cigarette. I mean, he, he grabs something and goes, oh, dude, it start all over again. <laughs> All right, no turning back now. Well, ain't that the wrong side? Really ain't, the, ain't that the wrong side? <laughs> There it is. Good piece of sheet metal. Stop. Like a full pan right there. Yeah. All right, we'll see set it on there. Need to bump back just a tad. Yeah, worry about cutting the interstroke because we don't have to cut the interstroke. There's no way around it, is it? That's a lot of interstroke drill right there. 
Yeah, it tastes thin on this one. Mm -hmm. Sure does, though. It would. <laughs> meant to be there with it. All right, let's fit it in. Got it screwed down, in place. Get ready to clean it up and start welding. 